guys welcome back to my channel my hobby house hope you are all doing good this is the rainbow themed decorations i made for my daughter's fourth birthday today's video is part 2 of birthday decoration video if you didn't watch my first part please refer to the link in the description box and watch that video first before watching this that video is all about the wall decorations in this video i will show you how to do the dessert table decorations Before going into the video, if you are not a subscriber yet, subscribe to my channel and click the bell icon to get notified about my new uploads. First, let's start with the welcome sign board. For this, you need a thick white cardboard and some markers. Cut the cardboard into the design as shown in the video. You need 3 pieces of clouds. I don't have a long stick, so I'm folding a strip of cardboard as a stick. You need a heavy base for this. So, I have put some sand inside a waste plastic container and I've covered it with some color paper strips. Next, for the name decor, I used glitter foam sheet. On the back side of the sheet, trace the letters as a mirror image and cut it out. Wrap a flat cardboard box with a color paper and use it as a base. Then stick the letters on it using a glue gun. Also, use some toothpicks for the support. For the umbrella, cut the cardboard in the shape of an umbrella. Either paint it or stick color paper on top of it. Then I have glued a stick on the back side of the umbrella to make it stand. Next, for the table center piece, fill some thermocol balls in a glass jar. I have given the link of the design in the description box below. Take a print out of it and cut it out and stick it on the skewer sticks. That's it. Rainbow themed table center piece is ready. Next, this is the trending piñata cake or the hammer cake. I gave it a try too and it came out pretty good. If you want the recipe refer to the link in the description box below This is the birthday cake it is a simple vanilla cake with whipped cream frosting I made the rainbow using fondant Next comes the rainbow colored panna cotta or gelatin cups This is made using milk and gelatin For this recipe too refer the link in the description 
This is the tassel garland or table banner. For this, I have just cut the crepe paper sheet into long fringes and glued it in a string. The rainbow at the bottom of the table is my kids own artwork. So I have pasted it in the center of the table. Then I have tied a cluster of balloons on each leg of the table. For the rainbow balloon garland video, refer the link below. So this is the end of this video. If you have any further suggestions or questions, you are most welcome to post it in the comments. Thank you for watching. Bye. See you in the next video.